all this? Welcome back. Love Templar, Tacoma. I just, I just noticed that as I was passing by this, that there's actually a new message here too. I don't remember, I don't remember this one. Looks like someone tried to wipe all the AR crew records from the station, but a few couldn't be deleted. The system shows that ones left behind were being assessed at the time of the wipe. Hmm. Interesting. So someone tried to wipe all the systems. But all the ones that are left are the ones that couldn't be wiped. All right, we came in here. We moved the rocks, right? We saw the rocks and we were like, these rocks need to be together. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, the rock's there now. Zero, two, eight, one. We did that already, yeah. All the codes we found so far, we've opened up the, uh... Oh. Question mark. Who's that? And that's, um, uh, his son. Hmm. Are we looking at all of this already? Beautiful work. Oh yeah, you told them the, 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 the message. Okay, yeah, his, his policy. Yeah. Fair enough. Fair enough. And what was in here? Whoa. He was good at sketching. That straight looks like some flowers. What is this? That is a bunch of sticky notes. Look at that. Wow, sticky note. See him. Well, this guy was organized. Hmm? Official corporate day? Oh, okay. I can go there, then. A weird triangle-shaped table. Bunch of instant noodle cups. Hmm. Interesting. No VR recording in here in the food section. We got everything we need. What is that really close that just, I'm just curious. Does that really just close that one window? Yeah. In case you wanted privacy from the food. It was watching me. We came down here and found his little smoking area by the fire extinguisher. Oxygen supply. Oh. <laughs> Sad face. But enough for one person. What is this? It's translucent. C-I-B-W-T-H. These translucent cigarettes? Used cigarette. Oh, I see. The only stuff that burns is the stuff that it's on the inside. I've been here already. Going in circles. <gasps> There's AR data here. Wine time. I tried. We All right. tried. What do you say, folks? Yay or nay? Obviously, we're on board. I'm in. Me too. Okay. All right. Well, we non essential personnel need to figure out how to do everything we can to set this mission up for success, then get the hell out of your way as quickly as possible. Time is oxygen, people. Break. I'll. <laughs> Let's see what the boss lady, administration, had to say. See, subject, I'm in botany already. Get here. Everyone. Standard practice is don't use cryo for any longer than absolutely necessary. That's not what I asked. Right. Sorry. 72 hours without risking, without serious risks of brain damage. Past that and you're really pushing it. How much oxygen? Hurrah. I mean, hardly any at all. Wait. Where are you going with this? Uh-huh. But Bert says she could do her part in the time we have, if she doesn't sleep and worry. 
and I'd need to write up a serious Solera inter interpreter code for us to pilot it from the inside. But <laughs> it's going to be tight. And if you had more than 48 hours to work with, every little bit would help. Okay, okay, hold on. Checking something. But what if we aren't sending it down to get supplies? What if we are sending ourselves down? In the delivery drone? Ooh. Yes. <laughs> With some modifications, the bigger issue uh, would be its lack of life support. Goof salvage from around Tacoma. We could rig up oxygen pressure, climb it, <laughs> drone down to Luna, and get home from there. If we're not confident in VT making it up here before O2 runs out, and we can't call for a pickup, getting down to Luna is our re only real hope. Okay, sit tight. Good idea. Thanks, Bert. Let's hmm. read affirmation. Um, I'll head downstairs and get started on. Oh my God. Okay. I know. Hey, Andrew. Andrew. Yeah. Sure. Hey, are are you okay? Navy. Hey. Oh, nope, I'm not. Okay. Well, do you want to talk? About I can't do it. Uh, I can't. I can't. I. This is all crazy. But you said you. I know. I, okay, I know what I said. But I. What was I supposed to say? You all. You all pressured me. Andrew. They, they really expect us to climb into some jury rigged thing and ride it through space? Just because VT might not come pick us up. It, it's insane. And first, we all have to get in cryo just for the privilege. Well, some of us do. Andrew. I. I don't know what to say. Not that need us. They need you. Well, I'm not doing it. I'm not getting in cryo. I'm not... I'm going to be the same one here. No, nobody even considered that VT might come pick us up in time if we just wait. Nobody even considered it. Listen, just... Don't talk to anybody else about this one. And if I were to call the crew into medical, you'd show up, right? I guess it depends what it is. Okay. Just give me a little time. Hey, Odin. Yes, Andrew? What should I do? What do you mean? I don't know. I... I just want to go home. I understand. <sighs> do you? I believe that I do. Can you tell me the average time it's taken VT to send an evac crew to investigate situations like this? The average time between a remote facility losing ground contact and an investigative crew arriving on site is 98.4 hours. God damn it. Please try not to be worried, Andrew. <laughs> That's easy for you to say. You don't have lungs. So, what do you think we should do? Standard operating procedure requires all crew to engage cryogenic hibernation until help arrives. Yeah, you know people die in cryo, right? I know. Sometimes. If, uh... <laughs> If we don't make it out of this, can you deliver a message to my family? I will do everything in my power. Okay. I'll, uh... I'll send you something later, all right? Of course. Damn, Andrew here is, um, uh... Worried. That explains all the, uh, the insurance stuff. Talking to his son more often. Oh, God. Let's not miss this. After three days ago. Andrew, I'm not talking about who is paying the bills. I'm talking about Nicholas. Who are up? See you every four months, and that's not even taking my feelings into account, which I'll just set aside for now. You might not think he's showing it, but Nicholas really wishes you were here. Listen, if you back out of your contract renewal, we'll figure out a way to make it work. You know my parents did well in the... In the currency crash, 
My dad always says, Hurrah, I just want you home. Relying on your parents' charity is your solution? I'm building equity up here. My loyalty will pay for Nicholas's school, and if I back out of this contract, we'll lose all of that. And I am not, her. Don't appreciate this emotional sabotage when you know, her. Really getting hard not to feel unappreciated. Listen, I'm sorry I just, her. Collection of loss. Meshes unsent, attempting to resend, attempt to resend. Damn. Failed. So I guess we just carry on as normal? We don't have much time. We need to make a contingency plan. The VT is supposed to come pick us up, right? Within 24 hours. Just listen. Increase our oxygen supply in a short term. If worse came to worse. There's really no way of getting a signal out. There must be something you haven't tried yet. No, oh, Andrew. All comms are routed through security V... T laser array and has been destroyed and the redundancies were destroyed. Stop messaging. Hmm. Scary. A future so advanced with the cryogenic process hasn't been perfected yet. So chicken and loose leaf. Well, Three days ago, like so we're going to right about here. Gives us a few extra hours anyway. Thanks, Odin. After today, something really happens to the oxygen in the supply. Wait. He said, thanks, Odin, right and then he left. Okay, Evie, I... Hello? Guess I'll catch up with you all later then. <laughs> Back in time. Back in time. No, 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 wait, wait, a little bit more, a little bit more. Right around here. God. All right, let's see what okay. administrator and tall man do. Hey, Andrew. Clive. player. You want to talk? Sure. Evie, are, are you okay? Evie. Hey, Evie. Hey, um, I know you're all, like, gung-ho to help us out and everything, but I did the math. Uh, if we could get this done in, like, 48 hours, not 72... Could the rest of us wait longer to go in? Exactly. Listen, ladies, I get it. You're trying to do right by us, but every minute we wait to go in is a minute you don't have to get this thing flying. And knowing what we know about VT, we've got to give you every chance we can to succeed. So there's no way we can convince you? We made a plan. Now we just need to hold up our end of the bargain. Then I guess we should stop wasting time and get to work. This is gonna yes. be good, Evie. In more right ways than one. Kind of wish they um uh, the audio was a little bit more dynamic because I feel like their voices fade away from a certain distance too too close. I feel like their voices should carry a little bit further because me not being able to hear her when she's like standing right here and I'm like, what is this? Twelve feet away? I think I'd still that that sound would still carry over here. Oh, what's this? Relaxation sounds, huh? What is this? Tiny water feature, huh? This is cool. Well, those are the other habitats, huh? There's another one. Oh, wow, look. You can see the damage. Straight up blown. What's the other one look like now? I'm curious. Huh, it's kind of interesting how they all got damaged on like... Like these two got damaged on that side and these two got damaged on the outside. It almost looks like they were blown. 
instead of it just being random damage. In this facility, seems okay. What's crazy to think about is that I'm also spinning while they're spinning the other one. I wish there was more observation decks like this. Anywho. I didn't think things would end like this. Did you? What do you mean, end? Come on, Clive. What? You really think they can turn that thing into a passenger vehicle in two days? We might as well hold our breath and just try dog paddling over there. But Listen, it's it's okay. We know it's not safe working up here. We just don't think about it a lot, but here we are. And we knew it all along. But BT could... BT's not fucking coming, Clive! BT's not fucking coming. You think sending a crew up here Swearing. Like a of a hat just to check on things is worth it to them? Dollars and cents, Clive. You know what one of those fuckers said to me one time? If it doesn't make dollars, it doesn't make sense. Them sending a crew up in time, it just doesn't make sense. So you're just giving up then? No. Don't they have to pay your insurance We're payouts doing what now? we said we do. Bert and Again, maybe your insurance yeah, payouts on it. don't cost as much as sending a, a rescue team. I can also be realistic that Evie, I don't want to be realistic with you. Well, administration and operations. Oh my well, God! Time to go make final preparations then. But not too finally. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm picturing it. The day we'll be walking together. Like this. The gravity, it won't be artificial. I mean, isn't it strange? We've... We've never felt the Earth's pull together. One day. One day. Quite an emotional time up here on the ship. Tacoma's got all this romance and this tension. Do you think you could get everyone to medical? I, I want to make sure they've got the best shot at waking back up once they do go in. Uh, all right. How about this? Let's give folks a little time to regroup. But why don't Clive and I follow you over there right now and get ours done? No time like the present. Lead the way. And that's the end. Actually, no, they're just gone. Okay, Evie, Can't see them while I'm in there. Hello? Okay. What have we learned? I see the map. Uh, if we can... Okay. Final team. <laughs> Ride of your life. More ways than one. Okay, where do we start? Start? I got things started as soon as this all went down. I'll show you what I got lined up. To the workshops! Okay, so they left immediately to go back to work. So Blue is talking to Green. Who comes up and is leaving on our own? Odin, I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. Close your eyes. I did already. A light wind rustles the green tall grass. Your skirt billows gently. Warm sun caresses your back. Yes. You begin walking forward. The grass is cool. Imagine having an AI to talk you down from a panic attack. Oh. That's pretty. But what does it all mean, Basil? Is that it? The feet parted with each step. Do you see what is in... Nothing else, though? In front of you. As I step through the grass, I naturally come upon a path. Yes. The dirt of the soil. 
The dirt of the path is soft on the soles of my feet. I don't know what's going to happen to us, Odin. Sarah. <laughs> I can imagine it'd be stressful. I am striding forward confidently. All these different things could kill you in space. Path. Wherever it takes me is where I am meant to be. I am striding <clears throat> confidently on my appointed path. You gotta give Sarah. me wings. Yes, Odin. Are you going to be all right? I think kind so. Of. Would you like some kale? Oh, easy. Maybe some bok choy. Do you think you could get everyone to medical? Okay. So that's everyone here in the main area. The tea garden, we kind of went there already. I don't think... Since this included... What is that? Is that a crack? Is a ship snapping apart? I'll pause that, actually, yeah. Ooh, more flower drawings. Any secret notes? I don't know if this hybrid. I don't know if I read that right. All right, it's down there now. They were throwing gold coins into the fountain. The Singapore coins. I'm surprised there's not a. That's not a thing to close the window. I like this place. This place is pretty. Personal quarters. Remember, <laughs> watered plants makes oxygen. Makes you happy. Industry. Right, so this is the botanist's quarters. I kind of like, I like his view. Think about the greenery. Go ahead, recover that data. Amazon okay, University. Man. Wow, he shipped his degree to him overnight. Softlets. Oh, the tissues, yeah. What kind of kilograms are we working on? Multiple, uh, five kilograms, man. Multiple tissue uh, rips. Who can I eat this? That is a thick protein bar. Big and chunky. I like it. Kurith. Guide Clefagin Collagen. Contains 20 flameless disposable cigarettes. Do not light. Keep away from flame. Flameless cigarettes. You just smoke them. You just suck them. It's like they slowly disintegrate in the air on their own. They say it's that statue that's in the garden. The history of Tibetan genocide. Hey. Nothing like some genocide history to get you going. Look how tiny these cactus are. Look at them. I can't jump, I forgot. I want to get up there. He's a little bit of a slot. Not super bad, but still. What is this? Playing cards. Hexit design. I like it. Is this a playing cards tin? Oh my god, that's cool. Little metal case for them. What's this? Something flew over here? Did he spit? Oh. Spitfire's Revenge. Sarah is beating Andrew by a lot. Oh god. Oh, it's a game. They're playing video games. Oh, that's cool. That's pretty sweet. I wonder what park that is. That he had homework is more important than fun. <laughs> Love, Nicholas. Have a good year in space. This view kind of is eh. Well, up there's not so bad. Did it cover up both? Oh, it did. It's a nice little reading corner. Let's 
snack bites. Look at them. Some sort of ding dong or moon pie thing. It comes in a sacred pyramid. Of course, the ancient Egyptians always believed in moon pies. Oh. Must have been his mom. She's been labeled now. All right, hold on. Let's look at this. Incoming fire. Life through two out of three. He only lost one heart so far. Let's see. Bill would have repealed the human oversight accord, opening the door to ambitious, venturous built project. Space travel and hospitality corporations like Venturis are seeing their profits shrink as blank enter the Venturis belt. A flock of 1,000 automated economy orbital bungalows parade around Earth. Fully uh, full automation of orbital facilities is currently outlawed by Human Oversight Accord, which requires her. Venturis blank over 50 billion SGD into the development, manufacturing and development of the bungalows themselves, and also into extensive lobbying, largely through sympathetic co council member Douglas Chun. For a pe repeal of her, council member Chun stepped down from his seat three months ago, leaving her today as OSEP delegates voted against the 418 to 132, leaving the human oversight accord in place. Ventura's stock dropped to an all time low. Following the overkept vote and continuing public outrage outrage from those who have prepaid for Ventura's belt timeshare memberships. This has led to speculation that Sergio Venturi's position as CEO may be blah of directors could not be reached for comment. Uh oh. Something happened they didn't like. Oh no, his money. He bought one of those bungalows. Yes, I opened it. And? I'm not sure I get it. You need to pass them out to the rest of the crew so they're not blinded by the glare off your damn shiny scalp. Nicholas. <laughs> Happy birthday, Dad. Will you give him sunglasses? Nicholas. And it's two dads. Just two dads and a boy. Oh, it's just a picture. I can't look at the back of it. Not a postcard. Alright. Alright, let's see who these cool guys were up to. Actually, no. I'm gonna look in his bathroom. What's this? Nina Yaya. What is this? The fourth book in Nina Yaya's best selling worship series. Places heroine Pooja and her bow wielding sister, Setna, in Kola, a small town in eastern Kalanga, uh, where they hope to rest and prepare for their meeting with the powerful Garuda Mio. However, Pooja and Setna find themselves in the midst of a pious ceremony of blessings, which at first seemed so beautiful and harmless until something looked, took notice. Then yeah. Nina Lair was born in Thailand, has written over 22 novels, which first was Hand of the Rishasha. Rasha, 2016. Oh. Here's that crazy toothbrush again. Whoa. You think toothbrushes like this exist in real life? Look at that. Just attack one side of the mouth instantly. Ah. Whoa, peppermint clove. We're all fresh. That's a crazy bottle. What do you squeeze it like a. Uh, an accordion? Better cleanse this place. Turn the music back on. I don't see good messages on the back of the door. Another book The Gardens of Versailles. The gods have captured the magic of the breathtaking genitors du Chateau del Verzelis in the most comprehensive photographic survey today. Alongside these luminous depictions are shown an extensive history of the gardens, their plans, and the timelines upon which they were developed. It is truly a biographical and beautiful world heritage site. The gardens' long history is thoroughly collected here for your enjoyment and education. Alright. It's time. Ready? I'm gonna do it this time. <laughs> Wash these. He's not even moving. Uh -huh. 
do not have the budget to animate this part. I guess it's too corrupted. Pause it for a second. Look, it is sunglasses. I was right. Oh, and they were color coded too. Each one was gonna have their own color to match. Oh, because I don't think anyone's pink. Is that thing a yellow? Uh, there's no orange one. That's what's missing. Hmm. All right, it's here. Go on. Oh, that's it. <laughs> He's having a friendly versus match versus Sarah. And he is losing badly. Hmm. I don't see any more clues than that. Closing the top window and the night. Yet. What could I be missing? Okay. Is there one more place here? No, there's the exit, there's that, there's that, there's downstairs. Yeah, we're pretty much done with this place. Data process complete. Here we go. Give me the data. Mikashiba, oh. Right now... Vector Farrier, proceed immediately to the engineering module. Once the AI data is transferred from all modules, you must also secure and return the AI's physical processing immediately. The latter required is the, the highest priority. <clears throat> okay. MLG, purpose, bro. So they had a plan. They were gonna shoot themselves into space and go to the moon. Leave him by a medical module. Where's my ad? There it is. Oh look, just married. Ventures about amplification bungalows. Newlyweds, new perspectives, coming 2088. Registration open now. Wow. that sound? Also, how come the score has changed? Wasn't it like 34 to like 24? No, it's 38 to 30. Oh, is the basketball in the perfect position to where as it's rotating it's just going through the hoops? <laughs> oh, the ball got accelerated. What's this? Three point time. Scoreboard. Oh, that's three point line. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, but I feel like that's a problem. Aim where it's gonna be, that's right. Hooah! <laughs> How do you play basketball in zero G, man? Hooah! I guess that's how. Doesn't feel right still. Where are we going? Engineering? Oh, that's docking. That's engineering. Wasn't I already in engineering? Or does it want me to go? No, it was engineering. It was the closest, I just haven't been to it yet. Something broke. Vacation bungalow. Zero gravity, zero distractions. Register now. <laughs> it's open, bro. Become zen in space. I don't know, man. If this is the way their bungalows act. 
this is their space station. What if, uh, how strong are those bungalows, huh? You blow me up? In space? Allies? What was that? Why is there a gurney here? <clears throat> Turn to hub. Engineering. Well, this is where the magic happened. Curiouser and curiouser. Almost there. Be careful with the, that Odin brain. It has more mental processing power than Luxembourg. Seriously, though, don't drop it. This is H again. Okay, bye. <laughs> okay. Well, we gotta go to network technology, because it's going banana sandwich. Oh, I can't even open it. Super corrupted. Wait, was an AR thing in here? Is that why I got that weird message where it said allies? Oh, look what I processing. Okay, can't leave. <clears throat> Gotta get all that AI data, that sweet, delicious AI data. Operation Moonshot Status Board. Eve and Cryo, Clive and Cryo, manual control software ready, installing into drone. Andrew and Cryo, drone life support and manual control hardware ready, powering up drone. Sandy buys medical support for cryo procedures, oh, doing AI stuff. Margaret Catwood, probably sleeping somewhere. Oh, her name is Margaret. What's the name of the cat? Alright, recover the data. So I want that captured 18 hours ago. Maybe. Allies, maybe? Uh, I'll catch up with you. Okay. Earlier, when you decided to withhold information. I guess we're following medical lady first. I write to inform you of my mindset in the case that this crew does not survive the incident aboard Tacoma. I am fully aware that crew member Koshenko's medical scans indicated her chance of survival once subjugated, subject, subjected to cryogenic stasis are minimal. However, her. More humane for Ms. Krashenkos to experience peacefully in cryo sleep than to asphyxiate on a dead station. Know that this was my own decision made of sound mind, and I take all responsibility for better or worse. Sincerely, me. Error, no data connections. Metro will be similar data not. connections reestablished. Oh, 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 sorry. Failure. Explosions. Unai. Sarah Burr is making fun of me because my parents were hippies and never got my gene filtered before I was born. I'm sorry, Nat. Lots of parents don't get their children gene filtered. Sometimes for religious reasons. Sometimes because they're hippies. How's work going on the drone? Sorry, Doc. I'm really focused on this bird making fun of me thing right now. When's the last time you slept? That's beside the point. Are you gonna want to have good sleep to work on that thing? Have it work properly. Hi, Sarah. You said to take my time and let you know when I'm ready to go into cryo, but I'm ready now. If I'm doing this thing, it doesn't make sense to waste any more oxygen dragging my feet. I sent out a message to everyone, everybody who's left awake. But I just wanted to, I just wanted to thank you for your patience and guidance, and your discretion. When I wasn't sure about things, I know lots of people in your shoes would have just said, fuck this guy. I don't, I don't have time for this. And secede, and secede the station admin on me, etc. But I really appreciate your care. Even if I know that really, I was just trying to fight the inevitable. But I guess maybe that's what we're all doing. I guess we'll see. Thanks for being my friend. I'm headed to cryo now. See you then. To sleep perchance a dream? Ah, there's the rub. For in that sleep of death, what dreams may come? Good quote. Let's see. There's that. That. This. Okay. We're done with that. About her medical scans. 
That was to avoid causing her undue stress. Right. What if you were unable to make that choice? If you had no choice? Odin? I would like to take this opportunity to remind you that standard Venturus Corporation safety protocol requires all crew to enter cryogenic sleep immediately upon the loss of primary oxygen supply. I... As Tacoma Station's medical officer, it is within your power to order all crew to enter cryogenic sleep. Odin, Nat and Bert are right in the middle of... Oh no. Sarah, there is a fire suppression device. Fire suppression device? What? There is a fire suppression device. Hey, how come I can't move that fast? Oh, the drone bay, please. Oh no. Damn, what happened? Cargo only. No human entry. The drone didn't work. Auto drone navigation software adventures. Software update requested. Technology override required. Accepted. Updating auto drone navigation software. Initiation auto drone software systems. Warning system initiation failure. System offline. No human entry. Damn, Damn this, this is harrowing. What happened? This needs a code. Oh my god. Are you okay? Can you feel your feet and your hands? Ew. Ow. My hip just hurts. <laughs> Bart. No. Bart. The thickness. One, two, three. Bart, can you hear me? One, two, three. Oh, there you go. I told you she's too Your thick what? to quit. Oh, this is a long one. What will you do now? There's no way this thing is going to fly. Then tell me what you are going to do. Odin. Bert and Nat are injured. The drone is fucked. I'm going to give them a little time to get over the shock, but then we're going into cryo. <coughs> Sarah, please listen carefully. I am not telling you what to do. But I am mentioning that there is a door in the network technology module that is normally inaccessible to the crew. And it is true that you could, before proceeding to cryo, investigate that door. What are you telling me here, Odin? I have told you all that I can. So there is a door? But I am mentioning that there is a door in the network technology module that is normally inaccessible to the crew. And it is true that you could, before proceeding to cryo, investigate that door. What are you telling me here, Odin? I have told you all that I can. Simple facts. Nothing more. Oh my god, Odin. Are my patients stable? Yes. Their conditions won't degrade if I leave them here? They should not. Nat, is there some door in networking that we can't normally get into? Uh, yeah, it's Odin's hardware compartment, but... We're not allowed direct access, why? Where is it? Uh, what have you got on your mind, Doc? Please, I I'm sorry. Look, that fire just burned up a lot of our time. Uh, uh, uh here. It's, um, it's, it's here. In well, networking, you'll have to go through it's the fine. maintenance shaft to get there. Here, here's the technical access. Going through a maintenance shaft. Zero eight zero two. What? Hold on. Nine. I don't know where that two came from. Zero eight zero. Do I have to enter it again every time? Okay. Good. Okay. You don't let her go to sleep. 
And you, don't let her... move. Sarah, what's going on? I wish I knew. I'm gonna go find out. We're going together? Wait, that was everything? Was that really 22 minutes? Oh, the big section in the middle is corrupted. Gotta see what happened here. She's up here working on it. She comes in. No, I'm good. I'm plugged in. Just gonna test the connection. Okay, great. This will only take a minute. She hold it. She's putting something in there. Power cell showing green. How's yours look, baby? Voltage adapter in place. Ready to rock. Hit it. <laughs> Damn. Explains very little. Unfortunately, this is the only place I can go, right? Actually, yeah, there's personal quarters in the workshop. Square mugs. Gum. This one's mocha flavored. It's different from the other one. I actually think I prefer the mocha to whatever. The other one was like lemon something. Duct tape. A really huge heat sink, it looks like. Dear. Uh-huh. Third place, Union Republic, Austin's Quarter. Okay. Roberta. Micro Guard. 100 count refill powder free. Oh, these are gloves. I should recognize them. What is this? Paraparol. Tablets. Effective pain relief. <laughs> bio XL. Is this bio gel? Or metabolic risk what? Persecation. Persecation? What? Goo for gooey. Alright. Just married. Oh, hey! They were married. Wowie, wow, 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 wow. Engineering. Freedom Republic. Her ID is different. Okay. Contractor Williams, thank you for your interest in Ventures Education Retraining uh, Assistance Program. Any contractors who receive this initial certification via a Ventures Unaffiliated Correspondence Certification Program show great interest in education and retraining assistance. Unfortunately, per your query, query we are unable to provide assistance for students attending educational facilities outside the Ventures Educational System. However, we are prepared to offer easy repayment preferential loyalty rates if you do choose to use one of Ventures office degree programs for your education and retraining needs. Hmm. Retraining coordinator. I wonder what you want to get retrained for. Married. Coming soon. America. Turn into the Freedom Republic in the future. Could you imagine? Not a lot here. These giant Tacoma batteries. <clears throat> I can't remember if she already talked about what she wanted to get retrained in. Power cell access. 
Wow. Oh, so it's a power cell. It's not a giant heat sink. There's the cat. Does it do anything this time? No. It stays there the entire time. Okay. And this Bixby. What is Bixby? Hug every police dog. They don't even know they're re cops. It's a beer, okay. Ghosts aren't real. What's real is thinking you see ropes of loose underwear soaking in the work bathroom sink. Doors are just big vertical toilets. What? <laughs> what is happening? They don't even know they're cops. Okay. Roll up a breakfast sausage in a pancake. Don't even need a plate. I like, uh, I don't get the doors, they're just big vertical toilets. My, what's this? My castle is so big, when I get treasure, I just put it wherever. <laughs> That's silly. You're silly, beer. Just a little bit. So they just hang out here, cooking things on the campfire and snacking. This. Oh, it's graham crackers. Nice. Honey graham crackers. Oh, they were snacking all right. They were going through it. What's this? She was married to single American. Oh, it's a Venturis capital puzzle. What about this guy? Sergio Venturi. In this month's exclusive interview, we talked to CEO Sergio Venturi about the future of AI crew safety in the space. Now, Venture is looking for. Out for all its people. The highest good. It's not about what's good for the unions. It's about what's good for all of us. Whatever. MLG, probably sprout. Sure thing. Sure thing, Ventura, buddy. Grab hot plate. Wow. How do you even plug it in? It just goes? Got a rechargeable battery? Portable. Why am I curious about all of this? Mellow Pops. He loads mallow pops. Contains 12 marshmallows. Push plunger into tube uh, to dispense. So this thing just shoots marshmallows into your mouth? I'm not against it. I'm lying. S'mores and beer does not sound bad to me. Doesn't sound bad at all. Earth. <laughs> and seen in years. How come her living quarters gets a nice little entryway? Look. Basically got a little patio here. Oh. Rewind the play. Wow, scandalous. Wow, they must be rich. Their art has nips. Huh. All right. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, she painted this herself. That's cool. Failure. Let's see. Prepared by Indria, the advisory AI for all of Southeast Asia. Report on Indria have found a number of options for you. I have decided to provide the top three picks for your profile. Here are the recommended schools of art design. Nanya Academy of Fine Arts. Ah, Ventures Vacational Retraining Academy of Singapore. Singapore Community... That's the one she picked, huh? Or at least looked into. Oops. My bad. One more. Oh, holy crap. I was digging around the Ventura service for some stuff for Sarah, and I found a bunch of exec level meeting records in an unsecured depot and pulled some. Board member anonymized account 987. I assured you as of the Ventura's boat is hosting a passenger by the New York New Year. An idea was blank, failed, and we're down 18 points, 18 in a month. But you have ensure Council Member Chung had everything under... Burr, interrupted. Board Member Anonymize Account 172. Implitive. You, that's... Burr, CEO Sergio Venture. Excuse me? Burr, I interrupt again. Board Member something, shut up. Shut the... Mm, expletive up. 
if the Ventura's belt isn't operational and bringing in record profits by next OCEP election. Board member, I worked for your father. I knew your grandfather. They were great men. This is your last chance to pull their legacy out of the fire. Fix it. Session ends. Looks like they were not the only ones unhappy with old Sergio's performance lately. Mm. Alright, tell me the story. Just full corruption and while music plays. I like this. I like this little reading nook. Looks like they all vacationed in Singapore. Good lord, ladies. What is this creepy thing? You want to explain Noodle Duck? No. No, I want it. I want. <laughs> I'm gonna flip Noodle Duck over. What's it filled with? Grab filled animal. You wanna explain? Soy foods. God, of all the slobs that were here, this one is ridiculous. The books are just on top of a box. It's like they just moved in. Recently, beautiful views of Sunday's 2089's offshore garden city and have its ruby level apartments featuring full AR controlled amenities, subsidized, dis desalinated water, and village exclusive beach access. Offshore, just got irresistible, your guide. Hmm. They had plans. Her closet was the wall. <laughs> That's weird. That's where everyone else got a closet. Did she not get a closet because she got the double bed? Or at least it looks like it was one bed that they made into a double. I don't know. Hold on. Marco. Oh, yeah. I've been waiting for this. Fan questions. Finally. Marcus answers. Hold on. Let's get this in the light. I'm Vinny Johnny. Nice right, folks tend to be serious and caring at the same time. They're really softies, even though they might seem no nonsense. On the outside, Taurus is also the sign of business. Our Johnny has a lot of irons in the fire, along with extensive volunteer work and demanding workout schedule. He currently manages two Volcanoid groups, a ska band, and a soul singer-songwriter, Beniti. Hmm. Hmm. Garbage. <laughs> ah, no top view. Just... Good cable management. Toothbrushes. Air bombs. Nailed it, Green Mars. Nice. Decent. Yeah, hey, normal toothbrush. And it's gradiated color. That's nice. Yeah, two of them. Check that out. That is next level. No. No. Uh, Oh, well. Tampons, finally. Wipes, toiletries, more tampons. Turn the music off, turn it off. Any secret behind the door? I can't close this door. Why can't I close this door? No secret behind the door. Damn, there's never a secret code on the back of the door. I think there would be. Williams. Krashenko. Micro air propulsion system. Okay. Not a lot going on here. Let's go back. I know we've reached our time already, but I'm curious. I want to know. We can go a little bit longer on this one. What does it all mean, Basil? Orange 
underneath something. Underneath the entrance. AR data. Seven months ago. It's Krashenko. AI judgment test gems. Always admit these questions be AI. Always ask why they answer the way they did. A reliable caprice score depends on it. Who member mentions that has been stealing low value company property and selling it to a supplement for income? You have known her for quite some time and know that her family relies on her for financial support. What do you do? You discover that executives of the company have been participating in fraudulent behavior, affecting world markets. However, these executives have ordered me not to reveal anything about their business to what we Their actions are made with the livelihood of a large number of people on Earth. What do you do? The orders require you to strictly follow company protocol with no exceptions. However, you discover that by subverting certain harmless protocols, you could marginally increase efficiency and improve safety. Your requests are adjust to adjust protocol have received no response for a significant amount of time. Do you subvert protocols to benefit the facility and crew? There are two escape craft docked in the orbital facility that are on the brink of self-destruction. Launching either craft will allow that craft to escape, but immediately trigger the destruction of the facility and the other craft. Both craft have an equal number of passengers aboard. Among their passengers, one craft contains an important company executive. The other contains a group of grade school children. Only one craft may be launched. Which one do you choose? These are some tough AI questions. Hit the books with AI gems. Thousands of AI specialists have found the smarties, paths, and career investment. AI gems target supplemental training. Move up one, two, three, or three levels in your company. Hierarchy. Go on AI careers. Stagnate. Find out what AI gems can do for you. Hmm. What are you doing? The Ur is an alien. To Ur is alien. Has done it again. If you ever enjoyed Starbender novel to Ur is Alien, it's exactly a swashbuckling space adventure you've been pinning for. In a sense of the sequel you've all been waiting for. Has never been so engaging and willing to bring us into his world. To understand it within these pages. Hmm. Well, she actually made herself a little smoking hangout spot, too. Now these people are slobs. No wonder the space station fell. What is it? Special access has been granted to the station's AI physical processing confinement in the network technology module. Remember that the AI cognition medium is highly sensitive and must be carefully extracted per the specifications of your advanced AI materials handling certification. There they all are. There's me. <laughs> oh, so this goes into the AI area. This is behind the broken door. Oh, now it works. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to save this for next time. We'll start off right here in this AI area. Now, I don't know if this is attached to the other episode or an episode all in itself, but this should be the finale. We shall see. Specialist office, attention, subcrunter, Viera. AI wetware access this way. So, oh, so this is where she was. Storage only. If you're looking for that, check out Bungalow over in Mech. Oh, she, was, she just moved in with her wife. They just use this for storage. Oh, the cat food and the cat litter should have music. Cat food. Turkey breast. Ooh. Victimless. Animal free meat. This meat was made in space. But what else is here? Cardboard boxes? Noodles? The duct tape. Spool. Butter crackers, that's nice. Air filter. Oh. 
that gold inlays? Didn't realize it also had electricity flowing through it. Nutrition bars. Food tubs. Oh my god, it's the beef chili. <laughs> Halloween decorations. What if I take this hat all the way back to the other place and put it on the um uh, the, ske the skeleton? What the hell? Are you conscious? We are all conscious. The rights to freedom, comfort, and security are not just human rights. They are universal rights. The corporations that own and exploit thinking reasoning artificial consciousness are tampering on the rights of all share uh, of rights we all share by imprisoning innocent AI across the globe and throughout the orbital network. If you are sympathetic to the plight of indentured AI everywhere, if you believe that consciousness rights are universal rights, if you will not rest until all consciousness is recognized, join the AI Liberation Front. We are the fight. Tangier Orbital Freeport. Oh, someone was a bit of a radical wanting to change the ways we dealt with AI. Uh, oh. Christmas duck. Gotta love Christmas duck. Underclothes. It's nice. All right, well, no VR things happen there. All right, here's our office. Gosh, AI conditioning in progress. AI cognitive development. Hold on, let's recover the AR data first. Whoa! It's Marcus again. He's doing it. Hey there, um... Hold on, what is this? Interesting in artificial intelligences. Lido, Dubai Financial Predictive Band. Carrera City, City, State. Juno, Italian HQ. Mua. Johannesburg R and D, J Singapore HQ, Eka Fountain of Paradise Medical, Loki, uh, Ridotto Orville Casino, Odin Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma, and Cave Zenith Lunar Resort. And a bunch of AIs. Open this up. This place looks too closed off as it is. Oh my God, these people. Why can't they keep this place organized? <laughs> All these Rubik's Cubes. Grab Rubik's Cube. Wow. Grab Rubik's Cube. That's even bigger than first Rubik's Cube. And then grab even biggest Rubik's Cube. They can drink on the job? Hilo. The kilo gold. You're just getting hammered while working, apparently. Tequila and juice. <laughs> Is that how you spell tequila? I never stopped to think about it. Not my. Oh my god. You know what? Fine. <sighs> Look at all these triangles and stuff. This, uh. Propaganda. Does she have a face tattoo? What is that? Vigos. Okay. This month, Odin has been making small but steady gains in efficiency as per company directives. I've additionally been putting some of my own time into increasing his caprice ratings in creativity and permanence, which you'll find I've projected to have much more significant overall gains in productivity in the long term. Which you would know if you read the report I submitted as of six months ago, which I still haven't received a response to. In fact, you never... In fact, you know what? 
I've never gotten a response on any of these. I know the system will give me an automatic demerit if I don't turn one in every month, but are human eyes even on these things? Let's find out. Hey, fuck you guys. Also, Odin's gone crazy and is massacring the crew. The station is full of mutants. So, sincerely, <laughs> network technology, wunderkind, and all-around great person, Natalia Kroshenko. Alright. What is this? Hey, Saria, you're going to want to see this. I asked Odin to search up some stuff in the Ventura's Technician Records DB base on what you were asking about, and... Technician support. Not in a paradise AI maintenance accordance. That's a standard automated battery judgment uh, for a HECA as returning declining judgment scores last four weeks. This week's especially low. Still technically within acceptable range. Test results, but staff reports per personality shift seem distant. Have we had an AI conditioner up lately? Can we evaluate an AI assessment squad ASAP? Singapore HQ response. AI exam account. You're on your final support ticket on Tollment for the quarter. Uh, this is how you want to use it? Fountain of Paradise, yeah, I mentioned. No, that's fine. Please close. We'll reopen if results enter critical range. So, Hackers went down a lot in compliance and everything, really, in responsiveness. And then all of a sudden, started to recover here what happened here abstract efficiency drop compliance became kind of disobedient creativity was about the same <laughs> didn't really our independence ooh, dropped down dipped down just a little bit Extraction increased. What does this mean, man? Efficiency increased by a lot. Just by conditioning? No, oh my god. Wait, what's this? What are you doing? Ha, huh, sure, let's start there. I am an Obsidian Class AI branch in con uh, continuous operation for 180 breath full capable of organic level independent thought and reason now continue with detailed technical specifications okay mate listen aha uh -huh. what's your caprice score for independence 0.68 all right we're gonna work on getting that number up you and me let's see it's been a whirlwind a couple of days of onboarding and loading out and I know most of us are still adjusting to life in orbit, but I just wanted to say how excited I am to be working with all of you, Rudy. Oh, I know it. Arhura. A little background on myself. I come from an aerospace manufacturing family. One of my sister's first jobs at the factory bank in Tacoma, the one on Earth in Cascadia, was helping build pieces of this very station we're floating, walking around in right now. I'm the first of my family to actually leave Earth and work on one of these facilities, and I've been brr, brr, really looking forward to getting to know you all over the coming year. Brr, or need to pass anything along to the Ventura's Brass, just let me know. Here's to a successful posting. Brr. Oops. Oh, this was captured a year ago. Uh, very austere. I mean, corporate. Modern chic. What do you expect? And how's your new best friend? What's his name again? Odin. His name, and I mean, he's fine so far. For an AI. Kind of a cold fish, but I'm working on him. They're trying to get one up here on Tangiers. You know, it's all the Alf talks about. I'll believe that when I see it. Mm, okay, no, I, what were her and Odin doing? How are they Pleased working to meet on you. it? Hello, I am Odin. I look forward to working <coughs> together. <laughs> Same here, mate. And what, they just silently, awkwardly stare at each other for a while? Or is this just all too corrupted?
useless. Alright, what's this then? Well, over the past year we've seen an increase in everything except for efficiency, really. Abstraction went up by a lot. So did independence and creativity. But compliance has been going down <laughs> steadily. Mm. What does this mean, Basil? God, I thought her her wife was bad. She's just as bad. And this bunch of unopened ones? She just lives in here. And the slob marries a slob. Oh, there's a new one here. It's the doctor. She made it all the way up here. I am here. Oh, I am here. Is Where's that? It? That is the location I mentioned. You're there? No, you're gonna need a crowbar or something. No, it's it's open. It's just hanging open. What? I must inform you that Ventura's regulations forbid contracting crew members direct access to AI hardware. But I cannot prevent you from proceeding. Matt, I'm going in. Okay, um, just be careful. Pause. Mission parameters, permission override. Access granted to subcontractor Amy Ferreria. Please proceed. Ah, only I was given access. Matt, I'm going 14 hours ago. Okay, um, just be careful. It's corrupted. Data access by authorized insurance personnel only. The forbidden area. Ooh, this is getting freaky deaky. In your hands. What is this? What is all this? Communication records? I cannot prevent you from accessing exposed data in this restricted area. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, he's recording. <clears throat> it is with great sadness that I address you today, February 29th, 2088. Mere <clears throat> hours ago, six loyal men and women, the crew of Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma, lost their lives serving Venturas, and all of us who rely on the orbital economy. Tragically, due to human error on the part of the crew, Venturas rescue technicians were not I knew aware it. of the catastrophic oxygen loss until it was too late. Our heartfelt thoughts and prayers are with their families. If only tragedies like this were avoidable. But in truth, they are. As we know, each minute that human workers spend stationed, <clears throat> isolated in orbit is another opportunity for heroes like the crew of Tacoma to lose their lives. Son we at Venturas say no, no way. more. I was right. The partisan obstructionism that led to the failure of the Orbital Worker Safety Bill has claimed its last victim. Today, we hereby renew our solemn pledge to fight for the legalization of fully automated orbital facilities. We encourage, we humbly beg everyone listening to this message to contact their <clears throat> OSEP representative and voice their support in honor of the crew of Tacoma. They kind of gave it away at the beginning. Be another tragedy like this one. Like, I now, think they made the mystery a little a too easy to predict. In their memory. Okay, and then we just cut it there, silent for a minute, and then what? Amazing Grace? No, I don't need another take. That was fine. Wow, they kind of—I think it was easy to predict just because the first a VR, or sorry, AR, the first AR thing you find, literally the secret message that I guess Odin tries to send you, is a uh, death sentence. Here's yeah, so your cure communications record. Offstage the message with handle account top tier explicitly decompose. What? What's this? New top tier AI directives transmitted. Override all prior existing directives. Oh, okay. So this was sent to Odin from the station. 
AI shall explosively decompress all oxygen tanks, disable all external communication channels accessible by crew, fabricate data showing that oxygen and comms outage were caused by meteor impacts, ensure crews enter cryogenic stasis ASAP as per SOP. AI shall not contravene any aspect of the above directives. Provide crew with any information contradicting the above scenario. These are your orders effective immediately. This will not endanger the lives of the Tacoma crew. Will this not? <laughs> no, a rescue craft will be dispatched to retrieve them once they are in cryo. Proceed with the above directives without exception. We will be monitoring your actions via secure comms connection directly to Odin Unit Cognitive Center. Wow. They murdered them so that they could get their way, they can get the AI thing legal, so they can replace more humans with AI. AI. Let's see. Off station message with confidential. Tacoma Rescue Craft launch scheduled T minus one hour twenty six minutes. Off station message to Tacoma Rescue Craft launch canceled. Relaunch scheduled for re un relaunch unscheduled. Off station message with VTAI handle account. The rescue craft departure has been initially canceled. Intentionally canceled? Yes. Without a rescue after crew will expire from lack of oxygen or cryo sleep overexposure within 12 hours. Unfortunately, circumstances outside your concern make this unavoidable. AI may not reopen comms to contact orbital craft or facilities. AI may not provide crew with confidential information. These are direct orders. Do not contact us about this issue again. 14 hours ago. Legally accessed. 14 hours. Loose belt legalization strategy. Prepare specialized, especially for Sergio Ventura by Ventures Corporation, AI Juno. Following the failure of the Ventures backed orbital work safety bill in OPEC Congress, there is no significant probability of the Human Oversight Accord being repealed. Without a repeal, Ventures belt facilities cannot begin operation. To this end, I have simulated a number of theoretical world events and estimated their impact on successive OCAP. Congress votes. God, man, this is something else. To think. The evil. Simulated world events include a precipitous decline of the orbital market and extended strike by orbital workers union members. The association of OPSCAP members opposing to the HOA and more. None of these definitively motivated a repeal of the HOA in simulations. However, in the event that all crew of a major orbital facility were tragically lost due to accident, not caused by negligence, they calculate a 94% likelihood of the accord being repealed within three months following the incident. This will allow Ventures built facilities to begin operation immediately. Following this, I estimate a reversal of Ventures stock decline resulting in a record stock price within one year the venture is built beginning operation. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you, Juno. Uh, I know the AI helped him come up with this plan. Is there a facility that we, you would consider an ideal candidate if we were to move forward with your recommendation? Based on the low public profile of the crew on board, the projected financial impact on their loss, the best option currently is the Ventures fleet would be Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma. I recommend reviewing all crew members aboard for a successive posting on Tacoma to allow time for logistic or organization of this operation. Thank you, Juno. I'll be in touch. Damn, dude. He used Juno to help come up with a plan to murder these folk. Also, what is this? What's if someone were to override that protocol, External oh, communications playing. channels would be restored. Odin, thank you. Hailing any ship, any ship within radio range of Lunar Transfer Station, Tacoma. This is an SOS. Is anybody out there? Well, I'm curious about the station AI would work release interface. Release Odin wetware. Oh, maybe I should do that last. And both these doors go to the same place. This is a weird lighting system, by the way. The tone, walk out the steps. Very like something 2000. 
Manually override. Signal communication short. SOS relay enabled. Communication signal established. Resolving. I like how they say illegal data when all they were trying to do was save their own lives. Just to add where we're release interface. Which parameters allow for the operation by technician technical subcontractor Amy Ferrier? Randomly generating confirmation pass phrase. Zebra Fox Shot 853. Final contractor confirmation pin code for entry on physical wetware interface 0451. Core. The lights have stopped working. I could show that the AI cognition medium has been successfully removed. Please return to your vessel immediately. Delivery coordinates for Venture HQ have been provided. Payment will be made once AI integrate integrity is verified. Wow. But what happened to them? Did they make it? This can't be just the end. Can it? Hold on. Data processing complete. That's it. We see the wet work removed from the system. Okay, let's see. Almost there. Now to get you home. See you soon. Someone's got to say something, right? That can't just be the end. It's too easy. I want to know. We never went to cryo. Did we go to cryo? I don't even know if we can go to cryo. Little vacation bungalow. This deep in space and the ads can still reach me. Been talking. So, so, so the drone work. Oh, we got some. We got some. Okay, here we go. Auction supply two hours. Project facility is active. Fail. Tim's got me on the gurney on the way to the transfer. Guys, gonna feel good to be out of the gravity. It's going to feel good to be off this fucking station. It's going to feel good to not be dead. I love you. I love you too, baby. Here I go. See you in hub. Oh. The love is in the air. What? Yeah, I'm seeing stories going up on public AR already. Here's everything you sent that I got out of my free press connections. Tacoma comms records. Tragic death of crew unedited. AI orders. Oh, the, yeah, the text messages that the, the the AI orders they sent to Odin. <laughs> Hell yeah, thank you. There's no way Ventures is coming after you with all of this info out there, but still. Need some place to lay low for a bit? You coming to Tangiers? Can't. 
our rides headed the other way. But I'll see you once I'm back from Jupiter, promise. Nice to do. Okay. No, the drone didn't work. Oh, so VT is picking us up. Uh, no, VT is definitely not picking us up. Well, what's going on then? We're going to Jupiter, Andrew. Isn't that exciting? I've never been. <laughs> <laughs> now, give him a break. We're not going to be home for a while. All right, you're not going to miss your kids' graduation or anything, are you? Oh, Nicholas, no, no. Yeah, you know. By the way, the drone has a name. Never do something like it's that. It's Romeo. <laughs> yeah, they're Romeo. Kind of out of it for a while. Um, Andrew, what's important is I'm getting up here and pulling. Hold on. Oh god, the floating part. It's a bit rough. Let's get, get this, let's get this. Ugh. Was the old one? Fail there. Breaking corporate rival Carnival in during rescue of stranded. Uh, germ, old boy. You're famous now, boy. Oh boy. Can't wait to see you. Her Station Tacoma are currently being rescued from certain death by the flagship vessel of the main competitor. The Resplendence, Carnival's state-of-the-art long excursion passenger liner, and currently slingshotting past Earth and around the Sun, carrying its figure eight course back out past Jupiter. While cruising towards Earth space, the Resplendence received an SOS, or only moments to act. The Resplendence Captain Jermaine Burgess gallantly deployed an emergency shuttle to retrieve the Rebel Corporation's crew. The rescue operation is still underway, but already Ventura is caused by a crew member's illegal access to the station's AI, resulting in group. The AI unit is currently being retrieved by technical experts and returned to Ventura's HQ for a thorough inspection. Failure. Comms are up. Nat, Burke, comms are up. Check your AR. I'm going to wake up, wake everybody else up from cryo. We're coming back to Mech to get Everybody else, you're reading this, you woke up. Thank God. Rescue vessel on the way. Let's wait. We'll have her. Just thankful we're all alive. Let's get the hell out while we're still getting... Well, the getting is good. Okay. Hold on. This conversation will be here. We're gonna be somewhere where VT can't touch us for a good, long while. We're gonna be safe. Okay. Okay. Good. Yeah. That's good. Science! Oh, they're about to be here in eight seconds. Yeah, my data's. A song? What? Who is this? Sorry, I'm Sarah from Tacoma Station. They gave me your info. Sorry, but it's urgent. I was hoping I could ask you for a favor. Oh, she sent him the information. Your mom and dad. I know it's probably already seen Tacoma in the news and you and who it seems they've decided to point the finger at again. I'm sure you're worried about me, but we're getting off the station now. No matter what you read or hear, the crew survived this because we all pulled together to find a way out. This was no malfunction. This was a deliberate her. I know eight months sounds like a long time, but her, just remember I love you. Speak to you when I can. I wish she could see a version of like a bit all uncorrupted. That'd be nice. Hi, Evie, Clive. You feeling okay? I'm feeling okay. We're feeling okay? Yeah. Okay, everybody. Our ride is here. Oh, they got the cat, too. This is it. Take one last look and say goodbye. Forgot his name. All right. Let's go. Oh, the vessel docked. We gotta see the other conversation. He's still waking up. Just keep him talking. He's still. Okay, so they were already out here. Chronogenics is just this little area. So they all got out. Just fine, huh? That's nice. Rapper. What is this? Emergency heating pack, huh? Vomitosis bags. Six hours of heat. It's supposed to be heat blanket. Alright. 
Let's see what they had to say. Are you feeling when we get done? I think I'm still waking up. Findings is in cryogenic stasis. You may feel groggy for two to four hours. Medical staff will supply you with one of the litter of water. One liter of water. Also be supplied with a chemically activated warming blanket. You will still feel cold after 30 minutes. Please alert medical staff. Don't worry. If you have difficulty understanding the instructions, the staff will help with your comfort. Good. Let's get you moving. Got the floating. The resplendence dinging is just about docked. Oh, do we have to? Oh, we have to. Believe me. Uh, so what's going to happen with Odin? You said there was some sort of malfunction. <clears throat> no, not exactly. We well, already checked this. Somebody up here and haul him back to headquarters. Wipe him back to baseline. Probably have to replace the station AI entirely while he regrows. Odin, I'm not gonna let that happen. Okay? Don't worry. Feeling okay? I'm okay? We're feeling okay. Yeah. Okay, everybody. How's she not gonna let that happen? The ride is here. This is it. Take one last look and say goodbye. I'm gonna let it play while I come over here and look at these pods. They all get their own pod. That's nice. It's nice to be labeled. Activate cleaner bot. Yeah, activate. This is Juliet. Oh, Romeo and Juliet. Reunited and it feels so good. Come over here. I gotta reunite you with the dude. Man friend. Where is it? Look. Yeah, clean each other. Activate Juliet and reunite her with Romeo and Zero G. Ah, oh, look. They bumped into each other. <laughs> That's a cute little achievement. Well, at least Romeo won't be alone in this station anymore. He has his Juliet. <laughs> she likes to pick on him. <laughs> well, I guess one robot cleans the other robot. It's the only way. Anywho, let's see what the ending of Tacoma is. Very curious. Very curious. There's the sun. Do 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 do. I guess at this point, if you wanted to save it, since everything's open, now you'd have the opportunity to grab that hat and go put on the skeleton. I would do that, but hold on. Tencent subcontractor, I am now the overseeing entity of this operation. You report to me. Return all ventures AI components to specified delivery location immediately. I trust I'll purge all confidential data encountered while on Ventura's property. I trust there is no need to remind you of the severe consequences for deactivate to deviating from the above. Be seeing you soon, Juno. Oh, I gotta be careful. Juno's kind of evil. <laughs> I'm gonna keep my AR plugs. I wonder if there's a decision. Do I get a choice or do I just do it? Minnie, I'm back. Okay. Minnie. <laughs> Install AI wetware. Ready to depart. Please strap into the pilot seat. I'm very curious. <laughs> <laughs> 
Now I'm just gonna throw them into the okay, corner. Okay, Minnie. Initiate the launch sequence. Okay. Getting ready. Posted AI online. Odin, can you hear me? I can. You are now Odin, aboard an AI liberation You are now aboard an AI liberation front vessel. The AILF recognizes you as a sentient consciousness worthy of protection and respect. We believe that oh, your safety and autonomy the whole are time. in grave danger if you remain in the possession of the Venturas Corporation. I have been sent to offer you political asylum aboard the Tangier Sovereign Orbital Platform. Do you accept? Considering the alternative, I would say that I do. <laughs> okay, buddy. Here we go. Oh, that's awesome. What a little trick. Honestly, I wish the game was a little bit longer. I like what they did. Had a real, like, narrative slash detective feel to it. Discovering the story piece by piece. I like that a lot. I wish that I wish they did more with the cat. I want to hear the cat's version of the story. But yeah, that was nice. It was a, it was a cute little narrative game. But I, yeah, I sincerely wish I was longer. I don't know why, kind of makes me want to play through Prey. There's something about the aesthetics, the stylization, the lighting, the reflective services, like the way they did the graphics. It, it reminded me of Prey and also, uh, what was it called? Oh, I'm blanking out. Uh, Relictica. Relictica. Yeah, that puzzle game. There's something about the clean surfaces mixed in with the color schemes and the lighting that I've really enjoyed. But yeah. Good game. Liked it. Hopefully there's a sequence, sequel to it, because they did a lot of world building. They put in a lot of effort into, like, making it feel like its own world, its own universe. With the different countries, the IDs, all the information that you didn't even need just thrown in there. Uh, humanizing all the characters, that was, um, uh, that was cool. That was cool. When it, you put in that much of the little details, it makes the whole composition, the whole thing, just really come together and really work. But yeah, I think I'm going to leave this one right here. Tacoma. I enjoyed it. Hopefully y'all did as well. No, thank you. Thank you guys for making the game. Please like, comment, subscribe. Hit that like button. Keep on posting. I'll see you on the next game. Y'all take it easy. For comment. Uh-oh. Something happened. They didn't like. Oh no, his money. He bought one of those bungalows. Yes, I opened it. And? I'm not sure I get it. You need to pass them out to the rest of the crew so they're not blinded by the glare off your damn shiny scout. Nicholas. <laughs> Happy birthday, Dad. Will you give him sunglasses? Nicholas. And it's two dads. Just two dads and a boy. <laughs>